Several farmers in Corrales on the verge of losing farms and orchards last year due to drought and also a broken siphon. Well, Diana Castillo shows us now how one of those problems is fixed, at least temporarily. Rudy Pereira is a farmer, owner of Corrales Orchard, and in all his years in the business, last year was among the hardest. I did lose some trees, but not uh, as bad as other people. The siphon, or pipe, beneath the Rio Grande north of Corrales broke. A big deal, since it provided a lot of water to the entire irrigating community of Corrales, as well as areas of Albuquerque. A temporary fix was put in place, but it didn't generate the same amount of water as the siphon. Well, I spent most of my time watering it by hand, and it's real difficult when you're used to the ditch. And again, this year, a temporary fix, but with a slight improvement. This year, uh, we were able to complete a project with PM to bring power to this location, and now we're able to use electric pumps. Before the electric pumps, Middle Rio Grande Conservancy District had two diesel-powered pumps. They drew water directly from the river into the Corrales Main Canal, but some farmers say it was hurting them more than helping. Well, we weren't getting the water we needed, so... It was hard. It wasn't like the siphon. Siphon broke and provided more water than they've been able to provide with the pumps. But there is a little more hope with the new electric pumps. One will be quieter, two, provide more reliable service, and then three, eliminate having diesel a stone's throw away from the Bosque. The overall goal is to build a new siphon and have it working by the start of the 2025 irrigation season. Until then, there's growing frustration among farmers. Their bread and butter depends on an abundance of the precious resource, Rio Grande water. I don't know why they spent all this money when they, they could have started work. They haven't started working and they don't plan to work on it till two years more you know, later. So that's why everybody's frustrated. We might, we might lose everything by then. Diana Castillo, KOB4.